Good evening, everybody. Great to have you with us tonight at 11. Elio Castroneves is $1.8 million richer after his fourth win at the Brickyard. And he spent the day celebrating his new status as a racing legend. Where else but at the track where it all happened? Tonight, we are bringing you some of the best moments from the 500 Victory Special, but we want to start with Elio watching his win for the very first time. Get the pink milk ready! Thank you, Lord! Thank you. I love you! I love you! This is IndyCar! This is IndyCar! That's what I'm talking about! Woo! Yeah, man, what a great race. Great job, man. Awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> That's pure joy and emotion right there. Yeah, I... I <clears throat> yeah, that was fantastic. <laughs> I, I get emotion and people don't understand it's um, that's what I uh, I did all my entire life, you know, and uh, to come back and uh, and do it again. It, it is special uh, and in front of so many people, so many fans and having an incredible young team. All right, Elio, let's have a little fun here. We're going to take a look at some video you probably haven't seen yet. Starting off with this tradition you started 20 years ago. What's this like this moment? You know, Dave, looking on the other side of the fence, it was absolutely cool. I, I, I see people uh, crying, I see, and that was what got me going. I see people exciting, people doing the number four. And this was special. I mean, we're talking about the legends, the gods of racing, and I'm having a blast. I, it, was, uh, it was super special. So I have no idea why I was running. I tell you what, Connor Daly show up. I'm like, dude. I love everybody here, <laughs> and uh, it was uh, so special, and uh, I, I honestly, I had nothing planned. I don't know why I was running. <laughs> I still don't know why, but I, I feel that uh, as people start uh, like chanting and, and, and making the ovation, I was, it was just sucking me in. <laughs> so sometimes people think, put a label on you, think yeah. you're like, ah, you know, it, guys, it's done. Ah, I, I love it. I, I <laughs> proved them wrong. <laughs> All right, so what's next for Elio? Well, beyond this season, sounds like there's nothing set in stone just yet. How do you move on from this with your celebrations? You're in high demand now. Wow. You okay with that? Absolutely. I mean, I don't have a full season. <laughs> I only have six races, five more races. I will be doing SRX races, and uh, it will be fun. But uh, I, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to enjoy it and soak it in. As he should. The team's co-owner told us tonight there have been conversations about bringing Elio back after this six race season ends and admits this Indy 500 win changes things a bit. So far, though, no concrete agreement. We'll keep you posted. 